my channel. I'm talking a little quiet because it's very early in the morning and Matt and Stella are still sleeping. But it's my first day at work. Yay! I'm so excited. I'm also very nervous. I don't start work until 8 and it's 6.50, but my anxiety says I should leave now. So we're getting wrapped up to head out. I'll talk to you guys a bit more in the car because I'm going to go to Starbucks. But I wanted to start getting up again and like establishing a routine. So I got up around 6.15 and lit a candle, had a coffee, did a little bit of guided meditation to start my day off right. And now we're going to head out and treat myself to Starbucks because I deserve it. So let's go. Today's going to be a great day. I'm so excited. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is snowing outside. Can the Starbucks open you guys are Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Can I please get a venti americano with a splash of oat milk and a pump uh, pumpkin, please? Can I pay for the person behind me, actually? Just a little something to make someone's Monday morning a bit easier. So sweet. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day tonight. Thank you. You Thank too. My coffee. Alrighty, guys. The lighting is atrocious, but you can blame Mother Nature for that because it's dark outside but i got my coffee and they wrote happy first day of work on it which is so cute so i'm gonna plug in my gps because fun fact i have no idea where i'm going i've literally been to this campus of the hospital like once and then hopefully I get there early we can like chat for a little bit be feeling and whatnot so do i want to take the scenic route i'll take this route okay let's go New angle. I'm gonna feel like it. I just put my tripod up, but it's currently 7:34. Anyone else's anxiety make them leave for a new job or like going to a new workplace really early? Because I left my house at seven and I didn't need. I literally got here at the time I needed to leave at. But it's fine because I'm here and that's all that matters. So excited. Also, thank you guys so much to all the sweet people who DM'd me last night on Instagram and like were like happy first day of work. Like the fact you guys remembered was so so sweet um but I'm, I'm really anxious i'm not gonna lie to you guys um i'm excited but and this is completely normal um one i wanted to normalize leaving a job that you love and two i just want to normalize like the anxiety of a new job because one no one enjoys going from a job they know everything about to like something they know nothing about like no one enjoys that obviously i love change and i'm up for a challenge but no one enjoys that first little bit um and overall i'm just really anxious because um while I will be working from home um until May mostly I have to come to a different campus of the hospital if you guys don't know basically the auto hospital has three different campuses and I work at the one closest to my house it's where I've been for three years I know it inside and out um it's like a seven minute drive from my house I could go back to the house for lunch all that stuff obviously and this one is a bit farther which is okay I don't know anything about this hospital or this campus of the hospital so that just gives me a little anxiety but I'm sure I'll find my way around that's kind of why I left early just so I could familiarize myself um but I'm sure I'll pick it up it's gonna be okay but I actually got to use Matt's parking pass this morning um because he's a parking pass for both hospitals yeah, I'm just sitting here. It's 7.36. I think I'll go in around like 7.50. I have no idea where I'm going, so maybe 7.45. I'm just sipping on my little Americano. I don't really know if I'll be able to, but I'm going to try and get my badge updated today. Um, and then my parking's already transferred, which I took care of. I'm just nervous, but that's normal, and that's okay. So I'm going to stop chatting, drink my coffee, and I'll maybe chat with you guys at lunch, depending if I get a lunch or whatnot. We're going to go with the flow, but... Cheers! Yay! Alrighty guys, I just got done my first day. It's actually a little earlier. It's 2. I was supposed to go pick up my laptop, so I was going to go pick that up on my way home and get that set up, but it wasn't ready, so they let me go early on my first day, which is so sweet. I'm so excited. I'll talk to you guys a bit more when we get home, but just such a nice team. And ultimately, I was looking for a job that like really just cared about me as an individual and like making sure I got vacation and taking care of myself. And they really seem like a team that does that. So that was fun. I have a lot of modules to do just to get familiar. And she said I could do a few today if I wanted and then do the rest tomorrow. They're like a super chill team. Management seems really nice. When I went in this morning, um, my new manager texted me and came down and greeted me and her and the director like came and introduced themselves to me and we sat like in the morning for a little bit and chatted it was so so nice like they're so sweet 
and yeah so I was there from 8 until 2 now I'm about to head home probably just do some modules and stuff when I get home then my computer will be here tomorrow which is exciting guys I'm getting a 2020 MacBook Air we're going out with a bang here so like I said I'm gonna go home do some modules I think um, give you guys a little outfit of the day decompress probably have a coffee or something Stella's actually at Matt's mom's um and she thought it was done till four so I'm actually just gonna go pick up around four just to have some quiet time maybe get some stuff done around the house but overall a successful first day I'm really excited kind of got an idea of like the job and my daily tasks and whatnot and I got oh I got my new badge I'll show you guys title medical education corporate trainer and I got my keys to all three hospitals I feel bougie so I'm excited about that I'm gonna head home I'll chat with you guys when we get home. guys my outfit because my ear girls are about to change into sweatpants but just wearing this turtleneck that I literally wear every day it's from Eclipse and these I wear these all the time they're just some nice pixie pants from Old Navy and then I just have on and some Ana Luisa earrings on my fancy Apple watch band and then this which is the Disney coordinates bracelet that Matt got me for Christmas I just wore some little black booties with it I, I'm really excited the package from Rose forever about a few weeks ago and I wanted to wait and open it until I started my first day of work just to kind of like something I look forward to Anyways, they sent this to me. This is not sponsored or anything. They just sent it over and gave me a discount code in case you guys were interested in it. Um, so this is what the box looks like, which is like super bougie. Look how gorgeous, you guys. And I just thought it'd be such a nice thing to like put in my office as like a little, you know, you made it through your first day of work thing, which is super nice. Basically make these like luxurious flower bouquets and you can get them in like square or circle bouquets and different colors and different like amounts of roses. Use natural oils to preserve the roses and they're just gorgeous if you want to use it as like home decor or even like a gift from someone, especially with COVID. So they were super kind and gave me a discount code, which I'll leave down in the description for you guys. But thank you guys so much to them for sending this to me. Like I said, not sponsored, just they sent it over and I wanted to share with you guys because I think they are gorgeous. So I actually just made a coffee because I need an afternoon pick me up and the coffee I made this morning, I didn't even end up drinking because I was so stressed. So I just made a curry coffee, actually cute little Hello Pumpkin mug that Matt got me. Um, but yeah, I haven't had curry coffee in so long, but I just was like craving a big cup of coffee, you know? So. I'm gonna do that, I have this, probably make a bagel, and then I'm gonna start working on some um, work stuff. A little while later, it's actually 3.40. I just got done doing about like an hour of modules. It is such a blah day outside. I just wanna take a nap, honestly. Um, but because basically a big part of my job when kind of COVID settles down is teaching new physicians, residents, medical students, fellows, staff, um, Epic based on their specialty. I'm just doing a ton of modules right now and going through each specialty and kind of learning about how they use Epic differently. So obviously I have a lot of beacon Epic experience, which is oncology. Um, but I'm learning about all the other ones, which is actually really interesting to me because you guys know I love the clinical side of things and like, you know wanted to go into medicine for so long so it's really interesting to me um but i asked them if i could kind of go through all the modules just to get an idea um so that's what i'm doing today and probably tomorrow just going through i can't really show you guys obviously that um but basically just if you were like a doctor starting um and let's say you were a radiologist starting so someone that does imaging um i'm going through all the powerpoints that someone would teach you like how to use um epic as a radiologist so like how do you order x-rays how do you you know like um send a referral for a patient to get a mammogram stuff like that going through each specialty and kind of learning how they use it because i think that's really important to me i'm a very visual person so going through all those powerpoints right now which is kind of nice because i can just kind of sit here and be cozy and do it but that's what i'm doing right now and then i'm gonna go pick up stella in about an hour i have to do something for my secret project which i hate saying that but you guys will find out by the end of this week what my secret project is so i need to do something for that and then I'm really excited because Matt's never had a hamburger helper and I'm gonna make him hamburger helper for dinner So I'm really excited. I also lit a candle and put it over here, which is like a total vibe 
But yeah, so I think I'm gonna close my computer down in a little bit just because I kind of feel like my brain is like really full of information I've gotten today and just watch some YouTube videos and relax for a little bit and probably change into comfy clothes because I'm still in my work, my work clothes. Um, I'm gonna go change and whatnot. And yeah, so that's kind of like my little update. Oh, thank you. Thank you for the gifts. Thank you so much. Thank you, my big baby. That's a big baby. It is currently 5.52. I'm gonna start dinner soon. Matt has like a 20 minute drive home. And I don't really know how long Hamburger Helper takes to make. Oh, not long. Well, I don't know how long this takes to make. Anyways, this is my favorite Hamburger Helper, if you're wondering. Um, you're like, Carter, you just got a huge promotion and big girl job. Yes, but I still love 97 cents Hamburger Helper. I hate cooking, fun fact. Like, I hate to cook. And I hate being in the kitchen, so I try to make it more enjoyable. So I typically have a podcast on, um, but I'm gonna treat myself to a glass of wine because I deserve it for having a great first day of work. So we're gonna have a glass of wine, listen to a podcast. Um, let's see what we're gonna listen to. The Brooke and Kenzie episode of the book club. Also, I really need to get my phone fixed. A glass of wine. Also, how cute is this? It's so cute and like bumbly. Okay. Cheers! Yay! The old news, but I just discovered that I can watch my YouTube videos on our Google Home so I can make dinner and watch videos. This is amazing. <laughs> We just ate supper and I'm gonna end the vlog off here because I'm about to sit on the couch, have a glass of wine, hang out with Matt, and enjoy my first day of work. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you're not already for more work week videos because the first week of work video is coming. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!